Apologetics. Apologetics? What does that mean? What does that mean? What does that mean? Apologetics comes from the Greek word apologia, and in simple English means a defense. A defense? Against what? Against what? Against what? Well, in the Bible, the Apostle Peter tells Christians to always be prepared to give a defense to anyone who asks for a reason for the hope that is within you. In a way, that's what apologetics is, giving a defense for our hope. Our hope? In what? In what? In what? Well, in who? Look, we're all being told every day by the world around us that things have to work a certain way. I mean, they say things like there can't be a God, or there's no real special thing about human beings in the universe, or that there's no difference between right and wrong. Not really. Uh, they even go as far to say that everything we see in this world, every beautiful thing we see, from every sunset to sunrise, all of it just happened by accident. Really? Yeah. Tell me about it. But what if I told you there was this book, a book called The Bible, that explains in perfect detail how the opposite of all those things are true, and that every question you've ever had about life, the world, or the universe, well, it has an answer. Really? 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 Really. And what's even better is that all of those answers, they come from the same person. His name is Jesus of Nazareth. Look, Jesus isn't just some guy that died a long time ago. He's the Son of God. And sure, he died, but he died for our sins, and he didn't stay dead. Look, Apologetics Underground is an attempt to share with you, our viewers, all of those answers that you've been asking yourself all along, and to give a defense for those answers so that you can share in the hope that we have in Christ Jesus, the confidence that we have in Christ Jesus, yourself. Because hope in Christ is what apologetics is all about. Apologetics. 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 Apologetics Underground. You've got questions. Jesus has the answers.